Sheriff's detectives say a faith leader accused of sexually assaulting a teenager through a church in Ottawa County is suspected of molesting others. Deputies say they found computer evidence showing more possible victims. Target aid investigator Ken Colker in studio with those details. Ken. Brian and Sue deputies say the 55-year-old suspect and the 17-year-old victim knew each other through a church in Grand Haven where the suspect had worked. Ottawa County deputies say James Beauchamp of Kentwood was working as a faith leader for teens and young adults at St. Patrick's St. Anthony Catholic Parish in Grand Haven. Was he using his position to target victims? Is that what your belief is? Well, that's a good question, Ken, um, and I will say that the position provided him access to those um, youth. I don't know that he was using it to target them, but, um, you know, he had access to the kids because of his, um, his position there. Beauchamp is accused of second-degree criminal sexual conduct, child sexual abusive activity, using a computer to commit a crime, and furnishing alcohol to a minor. Obviously, it's a disturbing case with some serious allegations and serious charges. Deputies say it happened at the Roadway Inn in Grand Haven, less than three minutes from the church. That's where Beauchamp is accused of providing the victim with alcohol, sexually assaulting him, and taking photographs without the teenager's consent. The Sheriff's Department says the Catholic Diocese of Grand Rapids cooperated with the investigation. Beauchamp no longer works for the diocese. Court records show Beauchamp had most recently worked for Wedgwood Christian Services in Kentwood, where deputies say he was arrested. They say the allegations do not involve his work at Wedgwood. A Wedgwood spokesman said he worked in the office and had no contact with patients. He has since been fired. The Sheriff's Department asked that any other possible victims come forward. During our review of the digital evidence and our um, investigation, it's led us to believe that there could be other victims out there. Um, that have not yet reported these crimes to law enforcement, and that's what uh, leads me to ask uh, for any of those victims to come forward. Beauchamp is being held in the Ottawa County Jail on a half million dollar bond. In a statement, the diocese says Beauchamp was working for the parish, not the diocese, had passed several background checks, and had gone through mandatory safe environment training. Anyone with more information is asked to call the Sheriff's Department or Silent Observer.